I, yeah, I don't know why I just did it. Anyway, um, <laughs> I'm out hunting today. <laughs> so, let's see what we can find on the hunting video today. So, we're driving by and, um, well, I see tables for a garage sale. They're out. But we're too early because apparently the garage sale ain't begun yet. So, that being said, I'm gonna go head off and see if I can find more sales. Just stopped at Value Pond back there. I'm gonna show you guys what I picked up. I forgot to show the clip before I left. My bad. I'm actually pulling into my next stop, which is gonna end up being Goodwill. But I actually found some stuff, so I'll show you guys in a second. So in a surprise turn of events, we got scores. So let's take a look at what we got. Um, these were all dollars each. Buck each. We got test drive. We got Halo 2. We've got Aragon. Halo 1. Harry Potter. Xbox One or Xbox Original stuff. Black Ops on the 360. And then this was like eight nine bucks. Um, Freaking Bomberman on the Switch. They had actually Pokemon Sword and Pokemon Shield. I wanted both of them so so much. They hadn't priced them yet. But the, the one girl's like, well, the one with the case is going to be 35 and the one without the case is going to be 30 I'm like, I give you 40 for both, 20 each, you know, because let's continue with the drill. But they said no. They said no. So there's nothing I could do about that because when they get the good stuff and it's the Pokemons and the Marios and whatever they got, you already know what time it is. So... I tried though. I did try. I did try. Anyway, I'm going into Goodwill. I'll let you guys know what I find. Oh! Well, I'm slowly starting to dislike Goodwill. Because they're stickers and they're... Well, I mean, the, the prices aren't horrible. Depending on if you could find, like, a good enough item. But they price everything the same price. A Madden on the Xbox is $4.99. Uh, the same as a Nintendo GameCube. Preview disc for $4.99, a not for resale, I might add. And then there's the sticker right there, $4.99. I hate paying five bucks for stuff, but if it's something that I know I can get more money, this is a preview game. People's got Billy Hatcher, Beautiful Joe, Sonic, Splinter Cell. I know I'll be able to make money on that. This one was complete and I hadn't seen it. Bad Boys, uh, Miami Takedown. It's got the manual in there. So I took a stab at it. But what's frustrating is they had a bunch of GameCube games in this store, but they were all garbage ones, meaning somebody had picked through the lot already. That's what the frustrating part is. I also picked up this one, uh, True Crime, Streets of LA. GameCube, and you're probably wondering, well, why would you pay $4, $5 for, for GameCube stuff? Well, GameCube stuff sells for really good right now. It is high. It's high and in demand. So, that's why. And like I said, it's frustrating because I know there was a Smash Brothers somewhere in there, a Mario Kart, something. There was something good there for five bucks. And that was all I was able to scrounge up was a preview disc, um, True Crime Streets of LA, and Bad Boys. But I mean, who can hit on Bad Boys? Will Smith is awesome. But uh, anyway, I'm gonna go hit up the next stop. I'm gonna get on out of here. I asked the lady inside, I'm like, like, where's the, where's the Wii? Where's the GameCube? There was a Super Nintendo cart that I didn't see last time I was here, so you could, I could clearly tell there was new stuff. Somebody got a huge score at this Goodwill up in Largo. Durr! Just stopped at that Cash America right over there. They didn't have a whole lot of stuff in there, but they did have a console complete in box that I actually put on layaway until until I can figure out if I actually want the stupid thing or not. It is a white... Actually, I don't know if I should tell you. No, I'll tell you, whatever. It's a white Wii U. It's complete in box. 
price charting has a complete in box white Wii U at like 150. They had like 80 something dollars on it. Um, just a loose Wii U is 130 on eBay. I want to say. So I'm, I'm getting it for about half price, almost. But I was contemplating if I wanted to get it, and I'm like, eh, I'll just put it on. It was 10 bucks to put on layaway. Nobody else can snag it in the meantime. So it's either going to be mine. Or I'll just let it drop, but I think I'm gonna go back and pick it up because you don't see white Wii U's in the box very often because those weren't made as much. Um, and yeah, like I said, price charting has it at like 150 and up or something like that. But anyway, that is one of the last stops. Oh wait a second, I forgot. I want to go to Salvation. I'm gonna I'm gonna go hit up. I'm gonna go hit up Salvation Army real fast, and then I'm gonna start heading back. Salvation Army turned into a flop. As I figured it would, they didn't have anything there. So now I'm over here at Tim's, um, trading a post. See if I can go find something. Woo. Well, I'm pretty sure that my travels are gonna come to an end here. Um, I did pick up two games. I paid more than I wanted to, actually. I don't usually do that. But this one here is a gem. Uh, Master's Edition, uh, Tiger Woods. Historic Edition Masters. This one's like 40 to 50 online. Um, I got it for 20. It's missing. I'm not sure if there was like a manual or something that went with it, but it is missing that. So I I know it's it it's a little high. I really wanted to pay 15. The number I had in my head was 15, and he's like, I'll do 30. I'll eat the tax. I'll do 23. I'll eat the tax. I don't know. And then he said he'll just straight up do 20. And then this was. This one had 10 on it, got it for five. So it was 25 bucks for the pair. I can't really complain, because I might get, I might actually get 50 just out of this. Black Ops 2 always trades in for like $13. So I mean, worst case scenario, I trade that in, and that's 25 minus 13. That drops the other one down to like 12 bucks. So whatever, I spent my limit for the day. I'm gonna go ahead to the store. If I see any garage sales, I'll keep you guys updated on the way to the store. Woo! So this will conclude the garage sale episode finds for today. Here's my finds. Some Xbox games, Harry Potter, uh, GameCube games, Bad Boys, True Crime. We got the preview disc, Masters, Black Ops 2. Um, there's all my juicy finds for the day. Um, and hopefully I'll find some better stuff next week. I'm sorry there wasn't Again, it's a garage sale video, and the only one I went to wasn't even set up yet. Um, I think people are still a little weirded out about having a garage sale during COVID. I don't know. I don't know what the deal is with that. But I will see you guys next week. Hopefully, we find some better stuff. And I'll see you guys there. Game Wizard out. Doosie! Okay, wizard.